Pak and Bin is as pretty as she is hardworking. She became globally popular through the king's affection and has a body of work to rival her seniors in the industry. Her filmography isn't all about quantity either. She is known for her excellent acting skills. Once she proved her capability to top Bill K dramas in 2016, she's since been landing lead roles year after year, establishing herself as one of the country's in-demand leading ladies. But there's a lot more about the actress. Here are 10 things you might not know about Pak and Bin. She debuted at just four years old. Pak and Bin was born on September 4, 1992, in Seoul, South Korea. Believe it or not, this beauty star has been in the entertainment world for more than 20 years. Before acting, though, she started off as a model for children's clothes in 1996, when she was four years old. She graduated in psychology and media communication. Despite having a brilliant career, she also always wants to balance between career and education. Her profession as an actress has never prevented her from continuing to study. She was one of a few Korean actresses who graduated with a non-acting major. In fact, she graduated in psychology and media communication at Sogong University. She cast everything aside to star in The King's Affection. As a professional, there will always be that one thing you really have to do during your career journey. Apparently, The King's Affection is the one project Pak and Bin really wanted to do. That is why she decided to cast everything aside and gave her all to join the drama. Apart from her fascination with the story of a woman king, she mentioned that she agreed to the project so she could don a dragon robe that would only belong to her character. She said, I was drawn to the idea of a woman sitting on the throne during the Joseon dynasty. A story of a woman in the Joseon era living as the crown prince and becoming king, this one summary line of the drama's foundation was so appealing. Although there will probably be more opportunities for me to act in other historical dramas in the future, I don't think there will be another chance for me to play a king. That's why I cast everything aside to do the king's affection. It only took her three months to learn the violin. What makes Pak and Bin an impressive individual is her noble dedication to acting. Her constant perseverance is what makes almost all her dramas trending and famous. For example, when she starred in Do You Like Brahms as a professional violinist, Though the crew did try to use CGI at first for her character, they eventually concluded that it would be impossible to insert the graphic violin close to her face. As a result, the actress had to learn the violin for three months before filming commenced. Despite the difficulties of playing the violin herself, she shared, it was exciting at first to play the role of a violinist and I wanted to do well since I was doing it anyway. Also, there was a time when I lost focus watching another project because I realized the actor was not personally playing the instrument. She can also play the piano well. Despite having to take violin lessons for her character, it doesn't mean that she doesn't have a musical aptitude. As a matter of fact, her skill in playing the piano is definitely not mediocre. She used a real gun in The Witch Part 2, the other one. In 2022, she starred in a mystery action horror film The Witch Part 2, the other one. In one scene in the film, the actress shoots a gun with a long barrel. She revealed that the gun was real and very heavy, adding, throughout filming, I had to check my posture. I was worried since it was my first time shooting a gun, but my worries were lessened since I wasn't shooting at a person. The firearms expert on set gave us live ammunition without gunpowder that was safe, so we used that for filming. It was really amazing. She has never taken any hiatus period since debut. Pak and Bin has devoted herself to acting. Truth be told, she has never taken any hiatus since her debut, not even during her school year. That is why she considered it one of her toughest moments as an actress. She said in an interview, when I was in school, there were things I needed to do for school. Doing both was hard, and I didn't have time for other things. I didn't get to go to places, and I didn't get to do anything exciting. Those things were tough. She's acted in 43 TV series, 9 movies, and counting. Fans definitely need a bit more time than most to catch up with her repertoire. She says she's not Pak and Bin whenever people recognize her in public. After becoming a leading actress in the South Korean entertainment industry, her popularity continues to rise. It's a common thing for famous celebrities that they will be recognized in public wherever they go. Pak and Bin once shared to Esquire, I'm not the type of person to go out a lot. When I do go out and people ask if I'm Pak and Bin, I just say, no, I'm not Pak and Bin. 
When asked if people believe her when she tells them that she's not Pak and Bin, she laughed while saying, some people believe me, and others just pretend like they believe me. If someone realizes that I lied, I apologize and tell them that I was just flustered and ended up lying. I think I just automatically respond by lying that I'm not me since I'm a really shy person. I don't want to be the center of attention and I just want to hide. Watching dramas or films makes her nervous. Her exceptional role as crown prince in the hit historical drama The King's Affection made her globally popular. However, when asked if she watched the drama, the actress said, I did and it was fun to watch. However, I tend to worry a lot when I watch myself acting instead of enjoying it since I'm thinking about how other people would react to the drama. I can't even watch dramas or films that I'm not in because it makes me nervous. That's why I don't watch anything during my free time. Her daily life is just going to the set and going home. Have you ever wondered what's life like as an actor? Being an actor sounds all fancy and exciting. However, it isn't for everyone. Actors are very busy. There may be some of them who can spend time with their friends or family, but as an actress who has always been active since her debut and as a homebody, Pak and Bin doesn't have a varied routine. She shared a glimpse of her daily life to the star, my daily routine is going home, going to the film set, and going home again. I can't have any other life besides being a homebody. Since I work outside, my time at home doesn't feel stuffy, and it's very important and necessary. There isn't really anything different from that routine.